In this video, we will be demonstrating Storage Made Easy's Enterprise File Fabrics features and capabilities around PII discovery and compliance. Personally identifiable information, or PII, can relate to a large number of fields depending on the compliance and rules governing your dataset. In this demonstration, you will see the Enterprise File Fabric discover and categorize PII information using its Deep Content Search. Deep Content Search works with any of the 60 plus backend storage providers and can operate on existing data, newly uploaded files, or even files that are put on the backend storage and not through the Enterprise File Fabrics interface. Deterministic identification of PII information is done with the Enterprise File Fabrics policy engine. The policy engine comes with predefined categories for PII information. However, administrators can define their own custom categories. A number of actions can be taken on PII based information, including the automatic tagging, emailing and alerting to administrators or users activity reporting, and audit logging of PII-based information. Lastly, the demonstration will show how easy it is for end users or administrators to find PII-based data. This can be done using tag-based quick searches, predefined or custom filters, and user-based text queries. File and folder markers can be applied to alert users whenever they are working with a file or a folder that will contain sensitive information. To enable PII scanning, an administrator will log into the organization and navigate to Policies. From Organization Policies, navigate to the PII scanning and detection policy and enable the PII scanning and detection policy engine. Click update to save your changes. My system is currently loaded with a number of PII based detection rules based on regex strings looking for things such as terms and conditions inside of a contract, credit card information, UK passports, emails, and IP addresses. The list of PII information is determined by you and your organization. Tagging can automatically be applied to any PII based systems by defining a tag for detected PII based information. Detection of PII information within existing files can be done when a new storage provider is added to the Enterprise File Fabric by an administrator or an end user. In this case, I have a Enterprise Office 365 account with a number of files and folders containing PII information. I'm going to add this by going to Dashboard, Add New Provider, and selecting OneDrive for Business. Scanning for PII-based information requires that Content Search is enabled. Because I'm already logged in with this browser, my authentication information was passed seamlessly to the Enterprise File Fabric. In the background, my files are now being synchronized or indexed by the File Fabric. And while this is happening, PII information is being automatically detected. Returning now to the file manager, a new provider is available for me. I also have an alert in my reports showing that a number of files were found with PII information. Enumerating my OneDrive for Business files, I can see folders that are marked to have PII information in them. In the folder, Marked Documents, I happen to have IP addresses, email addresses, and financial data. Switching back to OneDrive, 
I can take a file such as this loan application and upload it directly to the Office 365 bypassing the Enterprise File Fabric. Returning now to the Enterprise File Fabric in File Manager I can manually trigger uh, a cloud refresh to allow the system to pick up new files that were added directly to the backend storage. I now see the loan application and it's being scanned for PII and then labeled as such. Alternatively, resynchronization with a backend provider can be automated using dashboard and setting up a scheduler for a provider resync. When working with PII-based information, it is important not only to alert the end user to their PII-based actions, but also to have a PII reviewer. The PII reviewer will receive all alerts throughout the system that relate to PII-based data. In this system, we have two users, Dan and Javier. Dan is a member of finance, and he is also the PII reviewer. There can be one or many PII reviewers, as this is a group-based role, whereas Javier is simply a member of sales. If we were to switch to a different browser that has the sales user Javier logged in and upload a file that has a PII violation, Not only is user Javier messaged alerting him that PII information has been uploaded to the system, but user Dan has also received messaging. Dan has received an email. Dan's email states that user Javier has uploaded a file. The location of the file is given along with the number of users that have access to that file and that the file contained PII based information. PII reviewers, like our example user Dan, have access to a number of tools to help them locate PII-based information. Let's first take a look at searching by navigating to the Search tab. You'll notice that predefined custom filters have been added to the search screen, allowing for a quick search of one or more types of PII information. The result set includes not only the file name, but the type of PII information found. Determining a file's location and what storage it's on can be done by opening the containing folder. This document happens to be in the Finance folder. Ad hoc queries can also be performed by noting text within a document, metadata tags, or modification date, a deep content search can be performed. Entering the term visa allows us to find all files containing the term visa within them. Once located, a user can open the file for editing or for preview. PII reviewers also have access to tag-based searching. PII-based information has been automatically tagged with metadata. This metadata was defined in the policy engine. Looking at these files with IP addresses, I can see that they have been automatically tagged as PII documents that have IP addresses. Whereas if I was to look at this loan application, its tag indicates that it's PII information with a terms and condition clause in it. Tags are a simple and powerful way to search your data. Tag searching can be done in the File Manager under Tags. Selecting from the dropdown, you will see the categories of data classification. Within each category are a number of tags. Clicking on the tag reveals documents that have been tagged with, in this case, credit card, U.S. Social Security number, or email. This PII information can also be searched using the audit logging feature of the Enterprise File Fabric. Files that are of the PII nature 
have been tagged and noted as such in the audit logs, telling what user, what time, and what IP address the activity has come from. To find only PII-related data, a filter can be applied to sort exclusively by data that has the log value PII in it. For more information on Storage Made Easy, please visit our website at storagemadeeasy.com.